Space Marine 2 is on its way. I want to re-familiarise myself with the thing that started it all, with the classic Space Marine, technically anniversary edition, but whatever. So we're going to play it. We're going to play it all the way through, and that's that. This is where I try and remember the controls, which I probably won't, because it's been a long, long time since I've played this game. Also, prepare for horrendous keyboard noises. You've been warned. It's not my fault. I told you what was going to happen, and it will. Even this, even this is just immediately hitting me with like a wave of nostalgia. <laughs> it's like, I, I've played the campaign before, obviously, several times. But then I played an awful lot of the Exterminatus mode, not much else. Because it's the best. Facing down hordes of enemies as a space marine. I mean, it's, I just found it way more fun than the PvP. It was way cooler. So, of course, of course all the time was spent in Exterminatus. Usually using a heavy bolter, because that was more fun. Also, you could stamp things to death, which is, again, just badass. Always straight to Exterminatus. you just got to chill out. Chill out. Give people a chance, you know? I also really thought this was narrated. <laughs> I'd totally forgotten that it wasn't. It's just a lot of reading. A lot of flashy, quick, eye-bleeding text. I hope there's a... Maybe that, I hope there's a bit more narration there at the start of Space Week 2. That would be nice. I should have been reading all of this. Instead, I've been saying totally different things, which is not as convenient for you. But, you know, you didn't come here for convenience. No one ever does. Why would you? There we go. Let's go. It still looks decent, to be fair. It's aged pretty well, this game. I can't even really remember how long this has been out. This is one of those games that feels like it's it's been around forever. Like, it really feels like it's been around forever. This was formative for some people when it comes to, like, loving the 40k universe. This is like, one of the first things they experienced, which is... I mean, awesome, but also... Yeah, right, it's... It's nice seeing it again. Oh. Look at that. Yeah. Objective secure the Titans is such a... Such a 40k... Such a 40k approach. Now... I forget, how quickly do we see the traitor? Not Titus, obviously. He's not a traitor. He's a legend. He's the Captain best. Titus, the orcs have massacred the Forge World's forces. Yeah, yeah. And they have taken the planetary defense weapons. Yeah, it's fine. Clever of the damned orcs. Keeps us off their backs while they loot the Titan war machines. To be fair, I mean, you would, wouldn't you? Pilot, report. Tevri's not going to be happy about that. We'll find another way down. I do like... I love the idea of get the ship to safety. On this planet, right now, is there such a thing as safety? I mean, technically going back up to the ship they came from, that would be safety. Relative? Relative safety? This is your plan. I mean, it's a great we plan. We need to get to the surface to take out the gun battle. Would you want to go home already, Sergeant? It's an awesome plan. Not before having a word or two with the orcs. Like, what's the problem? Is that wise, Captain? The Shut your face. Not Shut your mouth. Try to keep up. Yeah, that's right. I mean, straight away, you know that you've got, like, the best character. <laughs> it's just like, here you go. Here's the gruff and grizzled Sergeant, and also there's this prick who's with him. And that's, that's your intro to the trio. You got the cool one, the cool but not as not as like badass one, and then you've got some idiot, pretty much. I mean, what what a start! What a start! Okay, are you gonna remind me how things work because I could do with that? Please let me keep the which disappears immediately. Now, if I remember right, we can immediately yeah. Just backhand these idiots so we've got the stun. We've got to immediately go in with just the, just the blade, because the blade is the best. 
shoot stuff, but if you can just combat those things to death, why would you not do it? So cool. You got dodge. I suppose I should, technically. Absolutely stab the hell out of stuff. Yeah, it's it's coming back to me slowly. The sound of the bolt is I always remember being really good too. And the fact that when you sprint, it sounds absolutely insane. Like, the, the weight of it? <laughs> there we go. Go about that bit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I, I, yeah, there we go. E to execute. I mean, it makes sense. It's kind of daft that I forgot that. I remember the first time I played this, I didn't execute stuff for ages. I just I just let it go until I was really low on health. And then I was like, oh yeah, I suppose you should try that. And then was blown away by how good it looked. Get off our ship, Spice Marine! No. I put it to you, sir. Uh, make me. I mean, what? 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 It's so good. I'm try and get out of the way of that nade. No, I didn't do that in time, did I? I think it's once you once you remember, all you want to do is execute things, and in a way, it just makes it like it makes the game <laughs> not repetitive. But I just want to stab things in the head like more than anything else. I want to stab things in the head in the game, obviously, just in the game. I'm trying to remember the various combos and stuff. But again, it's been a while. It's been a while. Something that I'm massively looking forward to in the second one, admittedly, is the fact that it's gonna have co-op for the uh, for the uh, campaign. Like that's that's the best. Because uh, the Exterminators mode is so good for this game, and being able to do like the whole, the whole campaign. It makes that's a perfect decision. Like a, a perfect decision. You cannot get a better decision than that. Other than, you know, making it in the first place. What a way to get down to the surface. What an absolute legend. And you think is you know it'll be fine. You know it'll be fine. It's a space marine. Space marines don't care. They just carry on. <laughs> until they suddenly don't. But then if you die from this, were you even a true space marine in the first place? All it is, is a ship crashing into a planet whilst you're standing on the deck of it. Like, that should mean nothing to you. I've also forgotten how much, like, shaky cam there was. <laughs> There's quite a lot of shaky cam in this. I've forgotten about that. I have heard from a reliable source that you can play Space Marine 2 with the helmet on the whole time. That, that to me, that is... Captain Titus, come in. Yeah. Damned Orc shot me off course. I've had no word from Leandros, but I'm picking up box chatter from maybe. Imperial Guard forces on the ground. I scarcely thought anyone would be left alive, much less still fighting. I mean, Heading look, towards it's... the front lines now. I will Titus, meet you come there. on. It's the Imperium. Everyone's always fighting 100% of the time. Yeah, we don't, we don't, we don't say the idiot's name. He doesn't need any attention. Kill them all. Hear me on, boys. This, I mean, it's just sad. It's just sad. Look. Didn't need the extra shot there, but I'm a bad aim. Also, again, totally forgot about that. I get, it's it's weird, still needing the uh, the controls being told to me, because like I just can't remember them. I feel like I should be able to. Was there a little Vox recording around here somewhere? Oh, I thought there was. I'm trying to remember where secrets are now, and I don't know that that's necessarily whether there's any point. I suspect the answer's not. 
we're being honest. Oi. Is it a bolt to first and then but yeah it is. The Emperor be with you. You know the one gun I don't care about and will not use? Vengeance launcher. Just don't like it. It's just not it's just not I dunno. Dunno, just wasn't a fan. Wasn't a fan of the old vengeance launcher. Sounds so good, listen to it. I got I got overexcited, but still. It sounds great. Like I feel like they properly nailed the noises. Especially the Gretchen, when the Gretchen die, I feel like it's just extra, like, wet. I don't know how to put it. Like, it's just so meaty. But I've got you. But I haven't. It's so just the sound of it when it's like... Oh, yeah. Go. What do you do for the... What is it that you get for the Gretchen? Isn't it you stamp on them? The little grot idiots. I think you stamp on them, don't you? If you just execute them straight off the bat. I always think there's Get things coming behind me as well. That's a... Yeah, let's go, team. They got no way out of there. Come on, deal with it. There we go. Also, we don't need a way out. We want to be here. The the, the sound is so good. You run out of run out of ammo. It just sounds great. I just want to leave it forever. It's just so good. Where'd it go? Okay. I suppose you to not get hit by that, I guess. Can't see nothing over there. Come on. It's dived into it. The headshots as well. Super satisfying. Oi! Come here. Go. Same for you. Come here. Didn't need to do that, but it's just way more fun that way. It's when you get the thunder hammer, that's when it starts to really get, like, amazing and sort of ridiculous. The thing is, I, I get very, like, spray and pray happy with, uh, with the bolter. Like, I get very... I don't tend to aim very much. I just sort of like the sound of it. I mean, that's just uncalled for, isn't it? Uh, you can't go on about, like, oh, you must abide by the, by the Codex, and then just unload on a corpse. The Codex Astartes warns against using jump packs to leap blindly into enemy fire. What does it say about wasting ammo on corpses? You jumps up, little shit. Just what out of interest. Just out of interest. Of interest. I'm just wondering. I looked at its rules for guidance. We all now, mate. You're an idiot. But there are also benefits to thinking for yourself. Right on. See straight away. Like just you know immediately. Admittedly, they make it very, very clear. The enemy. <laughs> Who like the uh, the the one that you know thinks more is, but still. Come here. Yeah, oh, it's punching him in. There you go. There you go. That was, that was it. <laughs> that stamping punching, it's the same thing. It's fine. End of the day, you absolutely massacre them. Sedona's picked up local Imperial Guard communications. They survived under the shadow of that gun. Yeah, because they're I want to know legends. Like it. There's no faith there in humanity's uh, defenses, is there? I want to know how they survived, because they're really good at the job. Come on, Tyus, let's not be uh, too dismissive of baseline news. Come here, boys. <laughs> I mean, you could argue that it's just wasting ammo, but it's not because you get to absolutely obliterate. I mean, look at the chunks on that. Absolutely blow, like blasting orcs into chunks. That, if you're not playing the game to do that, then what are you doing here? So the 
basket and sound awesome too. They just the, the overall sound design is so good. You have saved us. Get all. Rise, guardsmen. See? You saved yourselves. <laughs> I mean Alright, Rise Guardsman is maybe a bit more noble than Ghetto. Not for the Lieutenant. Where will we find this Lieutenant? At the front lines. Follow the trench network to the Lieutenant's command bunker. Carry on, Guardsman. Love the fact that they use the, the correct pronunciation of Lieutenant there, by the way. Lieutenant. We need updated intel on the gun battery. How do we fire it? Where are the batteries, etc. etc. Through here, my lords. Head out the upper level and continue through the plaza. The bunker is beyond that. Yeah, we'll do, mate. Nice one. A few hundred against a million orcs. Yeah, they sounds like good them. orcs. No. Get off. Orcs? Orcs. I can't feel my legs. I'd love to see a space Who said that? Was that you? I can put you out of your misery if you want. Is that is that not on? Is that... Oi, idiot. What does the codex say about shooting guardsmen in the head because they can't feel their legs? Is that a uh, is that a legit thing or or what? You're the walking encyclopedia of boring. What do you think? Captain, I'm in position at a broken monument near the guard lines. Oh. Well, luckily. <laughs> just <laughs> the way the screen shakes every time you put your foot down. It never gets old. Literally never gets old. It's so good. There he is. Yeah. Sergeant. I see you found something to keep you busy. <laughs> what hero? Why not, Captain? I've saved some orcs for you. Cheers. That was, that was definitely orcs what we're asking. Got that gun well defended, no mistake. A typical orc <laughs> behavior <laughs> Again, to dismantle the sound or destroy design. the gun. Ten out of ten. not use it to keep our forces at bay. There's a strategy behind it. Their leader is no fool. This day is getting suspicious, isn't it? Bit suspicious, bit dodgy, bit I dodgy. The orc during our jump to the surface. That was the orc ship I saw crash near here. I take it. Did he survive? Oh, if the horde hasn't yeah. turned on itself, it's oh, still his control. Yeah. Oh, there we go. The Mark Eleven Hell's Teeth Chainsaw. <laughs> yeah, sure. Mouse to yeah, you, yeah, mouse fight, yeah, okay. I can't remember what mouse 5 is on. My mouse. Oh, that's what it is, okay. What's that? What's that? So good. So good. Didn't get old, does it? Oh. Don't, toy, don't toy with them, lads. Just toy with them. That, that's the shot. You, you got to finish him off with a boot to the face. As if being... I mean, I hate to be vulgar here, but, like, hate-fucked by a chainsaw wasn't enough. Um, boys. Also, I mean, there's no cover mechanic in this game because they're space marines and they are the cover. But that does mean that I'm always on the verge of like losing a bunch of health for no reason. Because being able to stand there taking a ton of fire is more fun than trying to like not do that, which is Target obviously stupid. <laughs> That's so good. Cool, lads. Like, why would I duck or dodge when I can just? Stand there and be like, lol, no. Was there something in this? I can't remember. No. I can't remember whether there was openable crates or not. It's been so long. So long. Ow. Probably shouldn't, like, sprint around a bit with the exploding squigs, but... Also, this, this is... There we go. I was going to say, this is where you, you want like a bunch of grots around. Purely for the ability to remove them like that. Oh, 
Mate, you were pretty close to that. Why could you blow up nicely? Right. What's that much of any grenades? What was that for? Uh, do we need uh, grenades? Q, that was what it was. There you go. Yeah, alright. Fair enough. Grenades are helpful. So we go. I have another one. <laughs> the speed at which the bodies flew there was immense. Like, how is he failing to kill that? Come on. Mate. God damn. You need to pull it together, Sarge. Oh, no, that was the idiot. Of course it was the idiot. Of course it was. Of course the idiot was failing to fight back against something that wasn't really dead. <laughs> I really thought one of those was still alive and it wasn't, so I just ended up graving it only. Drop ship incoming! Yeah, and? And? Come on! Oh, there we go. I mean, it's just... I just, just love the fact that the game gives you the opportunity to have, like, a shooting gallery of just... just targets. Just so many targets. It's like, we all know what you're here for. What you're here for is to just blast a bunch of orcs in the face and we will give you what you want. Oh yeah, one of these guys. Have one of them. <laughs> that was pretty quick. Oh yeah, it's the, uh, the time event. So good. So good. Already gone. All right, fine. We thought oh, we were oh. really close to run out of ammo. Inside, but the door is I did use a lot. Believe they let us through. Come on. Imperial guard. Oh, knock, knock. Ultra Marines, open this door. Knock, knock, bitch. Let's go. Thank you. All right. Space Marines. <laughs> Space Marines. All right, mate. Not even a salute. All right, fine. I didn't even stand up. Another horde of the Greenskins are heading here. There we go. Ah, nice. Love the helmet. 10 out of 10. Right, lads. What about you? Gonna... No? Well, I mean, I'll let you two off. I think you're act. Yes, you're both actually dead. I think. Yeah. I mean, the guy lying face down, definitely dead. You'd think that if the other guy was alive, they would probably move him away. I do love the way they... The ones that can stand up do. Oh, so much death. So much death. Hello, you are an absolute hero. Best character in the game outside of Titus. Thank the Emperor. I mean, she is. Let's be real. Let's be totally honest. Second Lieutenant she Mira, is. 203rd Cadian Regiment. Captain Titus of the Ultramarines. You are in command. Yeah, you got a problem with left, that. My Lord. Unless my commanders rise from the grave. Come on, Sarge. So far, they seem content to stay put. Left There's no need for that. The scouts have returned to forward base. How many? Two. Like, just the doubt ten. there. I sent out ten. The doubt? You're in charge. So, well, why not? What's your problem? That damn gun. We don't have the numbers to make an assault. And as you might have seen, it's shooting do down now. all our support vessels. And that is why we are here. Leave the gun to us. Come with me, then. <laughs> I do look. It's it's all the absurdity of 40k, down. isn't it? Like they've they've nailed the absurdity. We don't have the numbers to take that gun back. Well, it's okay because I'm here and I've brought two other people, and we will be enough. It's it's just it's so good. Oh yeah, I totally forgot that mechanic. Yeah, there we go. Well, if you're wondering why I'm using mouse and keyboard instead of controller, by the way, it's because my aim is bad enough with a mouse. Like, a, with, with a controller? It's appalling. We need to reach that Titan. Your fastest route is across the rail bridge behind the gun complex. It leads directly to the western gates of the Manufactorum. This is why she's in charge, Sergeant. Because she knows what she's talking about. You got a problem with that? Get me that field bunny oh, yeah. Stuck on bloody oh, forge look, look, look not a the, single tech the earth shaking cannons. Oh yeah. Yeah. When can we pick up one of them? I mean never, we already know that. But <laughs> it'd be great if we could. Oh hello. 
See, this is where they kind of want you to use Fury immediately, but it's it's like I could also just go buck wild with a bolter. Sounds like a dodgy DVD, huh? DVD, what year is it? Or just go absolutely ham with the chainsaw, which is also acceptable. No, there's no need to do it right now. You take more hits doing that, but it's more fun that way. And also you get to stand to death, which is his, his own reward, I would argue. Get off the get off Lieutenant Mirror if she's the best. I may have just tried to cut her with a chainsaw, but that was an accident. Come here, give me some ammo. Give me some ammo, thank you. Right, let's let's keep going. The use of the Hades drill as well. So good. That's such a delayed dodge there. Right, boys. Like this. Oh, I think they're all. Yep, they're already dead. Oh, come on. I can't remember how much dismemberment you get on things, actually. I think it depends on what you use, doesn't it? No, the sacred gun. Hello, boys. How are we doing? Oh, yeah. Yes. See, this is... This is the this is the bit I actually like the most, just in the game. <laughs> I love the heavy, I love having the heavy bolter. Like it's so good, it's so satisfying. If I could just use this all game, I would I I would do it. I don't, I don't care. I don't I would I would do it every single. I would run the entire game just with the heavy bolter. Like it's nice that they give you a bunch of weapons. Here and stuff, but oh, there it is. Not sure. Uh, only time she needed to do that for that combo. <laughs> and in the external artist mode as well, I can't remember if you do it. I think you do it in the campaign. Once you're holding it, you can do like a big stamp, and you can upgrade it to do more damage, and, <laughs> and it kills stuff really quickly. So you're still like horrendous close range. But just by stamping on the floor for some reason, which is class, and I'm not complaining. Come here. Come here! There's no need for that. No need for that. Let me through. Come on. I'm trying to help here. My right, boys. Oh, is he gonna go? Yeah! Got him. Authorization confirmed. Access granted. Oh, I. Okay. Totally forgotten about the Stalker Bolter being in this. Yeah, I mean it's fine. I mean, I mean you, you know, you've got a nice, you've got a nice uh, sniper option, but it's not as good as stamping on people's heads, is it? That's where the orcs breached the That's gun the battery. We haven't been able to make it inside the wall. There just aren't enough of us. <laughs> you say that, you but this long on your own, Lieutenant. There you go. You have done well, but you are no longer alone. Support. You will retake the gun. You will get your reinforcements. Hell yeah. I'll hold you to that, Captain. See, she she knows. She knows that we're going to do good, and now she feels she feels better because we've told her that she's done good. We're heading back to the command post, Captain. Supportive Wait, words from Space Marines. It's more important than you think. You know what? This feels like a good place to call the first episode. We're going to stop there, and then when we come back, we're going to assault the gun fortress emplacement or whatever it just said on the screen that I can't remember immediately. This is just as much fun as I remember. It might be more fun than I remember, which is something, because it was already really fun when I first played it, and it seems to have not changed. It's still great. So yeah, we'll be back for another round of Absolute Murder. Shortly, probably. Give it like 48 hours and the next one will be up. Let's do it that way, every couple of days. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you for the next one. <laughs>